Hey guys, it's your girl Lashandra Money. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and subscribe because you're gonna love it here. Today I'm gonna be starting my back to school series. Um, and so for this first video is for my college students. <laughs> Um, I'm going to be telling you guys what to bring for your dorm rooms. If you haven't started shopping yet, you need to go to start now. Because I'm telling y'all, stuff going to be selling out. So you don't want to get the last deals and stuff. So that's why I'm here. I'm helping y'all to plan what y'all need. So we're just going to get right into the video. First things first. And I'm going to put the stuff right here. And I'll probably put it in the description as well. But first thing first we're going to do is room. So for your room, of course, you're going to need a comforter. You're going to need some sheets. And, of course, some backup sheets. So I would say maybe, like, get two packs of sheets. If your comforter don't come with sheets already. But if it comes, if your comforter comes with sheets, then just get an extra pair of sheets. Because on wash day, you might not want to wait for that to wash and make up your bed again. So you just have little sheets and stuff like that. So yeah next thing is a mattress pad slash topper you just see those beds i'm not gonna say they're uncomfortable but for you to get the comfort that you want you gonna need a mattress topper um target has some really really good ones i got mine from target last year for like 40 dollars, and it was real good slow real good on it um next thing is this is optional you don't really need it but it's a bed skirt and that's basically it so if you put your bed up high you can put the skirt on so it has hot the things under your bed but you don't need this like i said next thing is bed risers of course if you want your bed higher than what it is you're going to want to get some bed risers and bed risers are good too because you can put more stuff under your bed if you have those so yeah next thing is pillows now don't go overboard with the pillows you only need maybe two pillows and then decorative pillows you can do like maybe three or four don't get on them pillows i promise you you're not gonna want to keep putting the pillows on and off your bed every day and not. okay you're not um next thing i would suggest is um a sitting up pillow i don't know what they're called but um it's kind of like a chair pillow i think they're called chair pillows but i'm gonna put it right here um those are good for if you want to do stuff homework in your bed or something like that and yeah it's just you just sit up in your bed like i just like it i got one actually i love it um next thing is some blankets you're going to need some blankets because listen especially if you can't control your air you gonna want to get some blankets, okay? And a couple. I'm gonna say like maybe two or three, okay? Two or three. Next thing is rug. You don't wanna, you know, work on that dirty flow. If you got carpet, I would very much suggest you get um rug because you don't know who been there before you. But if you got like towel floors then you might can get away without doing rug because you can just mop that or whatever next thing is curtain you really don't need no curtain but if you're trying to like jazz up the place you can do a curtain but like i said you don't really need curtains because most of it's gonna come with blinds you just close your blinds um next thing is trash can okay trash can every year everybody get them little tiny little cr trash can i'm putting right here i got it too but everybody get them little trash cans that's so cute but they fill up in like a day so i would say get a big trash can but if you have like a roommate or something like that i would just say discuss that with you and your roommate and y'all can just get a big trash can together and use that save y'all some coins next thing is a clock now nah, you don't need no clock because i know y'all not going to use that clock but it's cute when you like trying to decorate next thing is very much needed for sure 
and the stitching cord says so surge protector um those ones when you have maybe three plugs that you don't have you will have to look up a lot of stuff so you definitely don't need a uh, essential cord next thing is tv i'm gonna say like this i don't watch tv at all like this tv right here i don't turn it on but if you watch tv you can take your tv or you can just use your tv for anything like music or something like that you don't need a tv but yeah if you want it then take it all right so the next section we're going to go to is laundry so of course you're going to need a laundry bin or whatever the case may be i would suggest getting a rolling cart because you just roll it um and it'd be much easier or get the backpack version which is also good because you just put it on your back and carry it to the washroom next thing you're gonna need some detergent i i know different people like what they like but i would say personally i think you should get like the pods because they're just more easier you could just grab two and take your clothes to the washroom versus bottles you gotta take the bottle it's just too much i was just getting bought because it's just so quicker and easier yeah um dry sheets bleach you know everything you need to wash your clothes i ain't even about to tell y'all that but yeah get your stuff to wash your clothes okay next thing is school supplies i'm telling y'all like this college i ain't gonna count with you you don't really use school supplies for real for real but you don't need a little bit like not a lot but a little bit okay um first thing first a computer like a laptop or ipad me personally i have a ipad and i love my little ipad next thing is a calculator if um i would suggest getting the t i think it's ti 83 those calculators are expensive i'm not gonna count with you some schools let you rent them so you can see if the school lets you rent them before you actually buy it but most likely if you don't have a calculator you're gonna need a calculator because you're gonna be taking math so yeah and you're gonna need that type of calculator next thing is a planner planners are very good because they help you plan like they help you plan your day out and they help you like not forget stuff because let me tell y'all when y'all in college it's a lot of stuff you're gonna be doing a lot of stuff you gonna have to multitask you got social life and you got school life so sometimes things can slip your mind and that's okay but it's not okay because you're gonna get a zero on that assignment because you forgot so just get a plan so you can write yourself down or you just uh get an app or something whatever works for you just have something to help you plan next thing is a desk lamp um this is really for if you got like roommates um if you're trying to study or do some work or something you don't have that big light on so just get a desk lamp so that you can be um mindful of your, your roommate um next thing you're going to get is a pack of pens or pencils um or pens and pencils like i said you don't need a lot but I would say just get some pencils. Like I like I honestly I don't we didn't use a lot of pencils for real. <laughs> so I would say just one pack. Like a little just get a big pack, I guess. Cause you can't lose them. So just get a big pack. And yeah. Pens, you can just get like a little small pack, like maybe three. Just to lose them. Next thing is extra phone chargers slash headphones so chargers y'all know chargers break a lot i said i swear I, pull, I, I go through so many charges i don't know how but they always just mysteriously break but anyways you're gonna need some extra chargers especially if you're out of state and you have like ways of getting off the of campus or whatever case may be next thing is paper slash notebooks i would say maybe a pack i would say like maybe a pack of paper maybe two in a binder and you should be good or if you want to do notebooks i would say do maybe like two or three notebooks 
like I said, in context, you really don't have to write nothing down because you can really just type your stuff. But if you like to take your notes like on paper, then you know, do whatever you gotta do. But if you don't like taking your notes on the paper, you don't have to. So next thing, a book bag or a tote, of course. Um, you don't need no big, huge book bag either. Please do not come with no big suitcase you just need a little tote or a little book bag you can probably use your old book bags i didn't buy no new book bag for school because what's the need so yeah okay so next section because y'all yeah, i'm rambling <coughs> next section is um closet slash storage so hangers of course you're going to need to hang up your clothes a shoe organizer if you have a lot of shoes you might want to get a shoe organizer so you can minimize as much space as you, that you have i got this uh tall shoe organizer what's well, my shoe organizer it's just like a shoe rack but i had got this tall one like it was like straight like it's like these boxes lined up right here it was literally that big and that wide so yeah next thing is um plastic drawers so in college you get maybe like one set of drawers maybe two in like a closet most of the time it's not enough space so just get you some plastic drawers and you're good next thing is a full body mirror if you like to take pictures or like to see your outfit before you like you go out you might want to get a full body a full body mirror now my school every room i believe every room every room had full body mirrors just check before you buy stuff but i wouldn't buy a mirror until you get there because i don't want that to break next thing is crates or containers so like a trunk anything you can put your like winter stuff in here if you're like out of state i'm gonna get into this a little later but if you're out of state you put like your winter stuff in there for the time being until you get cold and yeah next thing is command scripts command scripts are you know, going to be your go-to because you can't put them on that wall you can't make no mess because they will charge you okay next thing is going to be in like the food section stuff pertains to food number one mini fridge you don't need a mini fridge um some schools provide them so just check like i said but you're gonna need them in the fridge because you won't need you won't need some extra food <laughs> next thing is a microwave um self-explanatory like i said this also some schools provide so check next thing is an air fryer um so i know a lot of schools be like don't bring no air fryer but this thing Hot that thing, baby, and get your air fryer because listen, you're gonna need something to eat and you're gonna want to cook or something. Get take your air fryer. Next thing is the cooking pot. Um, it's it's like an electric pot, I think it's like three dollars on Amazon, or I think you can get some some other places, but that um, I feel like comes in handy as well. I, I know schools say don't get that either, but like I said, hot. <laughs> next thing is plastic utensils bowl slash plates and bowls so yeah i would suggest getting plastic everything because you're not going to want to wash no dishes and especially if you don't have like an actual sink uh in your room i'm not talking about like a bathroom sink but um like an actual kitchen sink you probably won't want to wash your stuff in the bathroom i know some people do me personally i, I just can't because i i just like the air like the bathroom air the dishes and i just mm -mm. so plastic it is <laughs> next thing is water bottle you gonna want water take you some water that's definitely what you need if you don't get no other drink get some water you're gonna get thirsty okay next thing is zip like bags that's like self-explanatory if you want to just store some things yeah tubware um tubware is the same thing like if you want to store, store some stuff 
Um, you can take this to the cab if you want to take those stuff to go. I don't know about other universal things, but um, my school used to be tripping about taking this stuff out or like getting to go plates. Um, so just take you some type of thing, put yourself in. Next thing is clothing, 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 clothing. This first thing, this is technically not clothing, but it's shoe wear. And it falls with the showers. I don't care if you got your own bathroom, communal, whatever the case may be. Get you some shower shoes. Say with me, shower shoes. Y'all, y'all gonna need some shower shoes. I am, I don't, I just, mm -mm. I'm not going in no shower without no shower shoes. It's so many people that have been in those showers over the years get you some shower shoes they it ain't not even that much you don't even gotta get shower shoes you can get some flip tops one dollar one dollar flip flops and you're gonna be good okay um next thing so get you some shower shoes and then if you in like communal or something like that i would say get a pair of slippers that you can wear when you get out of the shower so you can walk back to your room because i don't think you want to track that water but if you know then it's fine but anyways yeah also get a robe if you got a communal get a robe because you are not going to want to walk them halls in a towel i mean it's it's not like not normal but you know just get a robe you just feel a little bit more secure okay next thing oh we're gonna close this subject if you are out of state you know you're gonna have to take your clothes but i wouldn't say pack a lot but pack enough you know what i'm saying if you're like kind of in state or you can travel home somebody can come get you or whatever case may be um you know just pack whatever you need at that moment and then just go back and get the season clothes that you need but um like i said if you're out of state pack good enough to where you will survive okay so next thing on the list is hygiene <sighs> y'all know what to get but i'm telling y'all i'm just gonna list because i'm not getting to deal with nothing okay next thing first thing lots of lotion um face wash soap a lot of soap deodorant please please get you some deodorant okay put that on every morning every morning okay we don't want to be we don't want to smell that boo get you some deodorant toothpaste get you some toothpaste we don't want to be smelling no sticky breath okay mouthwash sanitary items if you don't know what I mean <laughs> um but this is for the girls so your pads tampons wipes so whatever you need for your light period soup brushes floss razors shaving cream body spray uh body towels oh this is a good one. body towels um you gonna want to come with at least i'm trying to be realistic you can do laundry every week but i would say how many honestly i went with a lot like i don't even i don't even know how many i had i would say at least get like 15. it depends on how you use your um towels but if you use one every day that's two weeks so yeah i would say about 15. okay wash gloves you're gonna need a lot of those well not a lot but you know enough toothbrush holder you definitely gonna need that because you're gonna have your toothbrush in your room and you don't want stuff flying on your toothbrush so just get your brush holder i don't know why this is under hygiene but air freshener that shouldn't be under hygiene but air freshener um a soap container um cotton balls such q-tips fingernail file whatever yeah next thing hair now i know the girlies I like to do protective styles and stuff like that but if you happen to not find somebody on campus or whatever the case may be or you won't need to do your own hair so yeah 
bring your blow dryer, flat iron, edge control, shampoo, conditioner, gel, and hair ties. If you need some bobby pins, add that too. Or whatever else you need for your hair, okay? We're going to go ahead by next thing is cleaning supplies. Now let me get into this because um, some people are not the cleaners. Um, I don't know why people don't teach their kids before they come to school how to clean but um on this channel we're gonna teach you how to clean look okay first thing first uh windex so this goes for your room bathroom whatever case may be because some mirrors get dirty quick lights off wipes slash spray you're gonna need it you're gonna need it paper towels you just need it now if you have your own bathroom and you have to clean it this is mainly for you but if you have communal of course you don't clean your bathroom some like a staff member cleans the bathroom but um i will still spray it down before you get into it but this is for the people that have their own bathroom so i would get anything that you use to clean the bathroom so awesome magic erasers bleach and then the next thing we have is broom and dustpan because your floors will get dirty or if you want to vacuum you can do that um stain remover carpet fresh if you have carpet you will need that trash bags surprisingly people don't get trash bags you gonna need trash bags next thing is medicine so of course you can't avoid being sick so you're gonna need this stuff on hand when anything happens so first things first if you have allergies please bring your allergy medicine because we do not want to hear you scratching your throat sneezing all that just bring your medicine please next thing is rubber testing i love rubber testing i feel like that's the best medicine that works for colds and stuff um, next thing is ibuprofen or leave whatever you like to take um, and then cough medicine Benadryl and masks now masks aren't mandatory anymore but I know some people or some professors will want you to still wear it so just take you a pack just in case next thing we have miscellaneous stuff um, so first thing first is first aid kit, so mandates, any alcohol, not that drinking alcohol, rubbing alcohol, anything you would need to like clean up a wound or something, like maybe you've got a cut or something, you're gonna need that. Safety pins, you never know when you need safety pins, just bring them. A small fan, this goes if you can't control your air. I'm a link. Actually, I'm a link a fan down below that one of my friends got that it has air and heat, and it's so amazing. So I'm gonna link that down below. It's on Amazon. Next thing is batteries. If you have stuff that need batteries, a speaker. If you need to want listen to music. Next thing is your card. So like debit cards, insurance cards, license, vaccine card anything like that especially insurance because like i said you can get sick and you want to go to the doctor whatever case may be you need to have all that stuff on you next thing is an umbrella y'all people don't bring umbrellas i don't know why but you gonna need an umbrella baby because when it rains them people them professors still gonna expect you on class they don't care so take your umbrella and yeah next thing this not mr means because you really need it but um shower caddy um i would suggest getting the hard ones instead of like the bad ones that you gotta put on a hook but it also depends on how the shower layout is for your school um i know for claflin and in, in dunton's door was right here there's a little space and then it was the shower right here so the hook is all the way over here so if you got a hook you gotta keep getting down the shower so yeah i would just get the hard one but like I said, check and see how your school layout is. This is also a part of the bathroom section, but this is for if you will have your own bathroom. So you're gonna need a shower curtain. 
um some school's hair shower curtains but you know you might want to decorate it how you want so just get a shower curtain some shower hooks most likely they will have shower hooks too but like i said but you don't have to get this stuff until you actually get there um rugs they're not gonna have that so get rugs so you know a sh one for the shower one around the um toilet or one by the sink <sighs> trash can for the bathroom um and then you can make you might can do a rack it depends so yeah i think that covers everything that i needed to say in this video of things that you need like absolutely need i didn't want to come on here and tell y'all stuff that y'all don't need because you don't have to spend a lot of money to decorate your dorm i'm also going to be like i said this is the first part of the back to school series so i'm going to be doing an advice video and some other videos pertaining to back to school i will get into the advice part probably in the next video so this is every single thing you need like i said every single thing on here you don't absolutely need but majority of the things on here you will need all right if you don't take nothing from this video please get a mattress pad or a topper whatever you want to call it an umbrella some shower shoes and you will air fry okay because you're gonna be hungry but yeah this is the end of this video if you like this video go ahead and give it a thumbs up if you like seeing my face go ahead and just hit that subscribe button so you can see more of me and comment some ideas and down below in the comments and comment some things that i may have missed so people that are watching the video can add that to their list as well and without further ado it's your girl lashonja monique and i'm out bye